Yo, hello people, hope you're well. Um, I just wanted to do a video saying as of, um, you know, after took my advice on acting and CV and stuff, but I thought I'd do a video about it on what I've learned and stuff like that and what I want to share with you. Um, it took two years to find my niche, to really discover my niche. And the way I did that is um, what worked for me. Obviously, some people, it is obvious from a third person's perspective, like your 10 foot bodybuilder, for example, you know what I mean? But for me, it wasn't so obvious. So I was just thinking, what the, um, what is the bad things about me? That's how I discovered my niche. And I thought people just think of me as like a little chav and a bit of nobody. So I thought, I can't just put that, do you know what I mean, from a casting type. So I twisted it and I put it in a nice way. And that's when I discovered that that is, is um, more like me, you know what I mean? The quiet indie rock player type, you know what I mean? Because I, I got more specific with it, cause, do you know what I mean? And um, and what you got to do is like, you've got to realise is, there's so many people out there that are in your niche because you can't just go on the TV and say, I like music, I like football, I like swimming, I like, I've been acting since 1999 or whatever, um, I like going to cinema, everyone's going to put that, you know what I mean? So what you do is, um, like, you've got to think, like, for example, my, old, my acting coach always says, what problem do you solve, right? So you've got to think of a, like a problem where a situation where they need, would need that niche. For example, if they were filming Rockstar and they needed a big bodybuilder, if that were to arrive, which is a problem, and you haven't got a bodybuilder, which you need to sort of put into perspective the problem, not specifically what you're about, more the problem, you'll be the right person for that part, yeah? You know what I mean? So, like, sort of, like, put on the CV, maybe, I love um, Guy Ritchie films, do you know what I mean? Um, I like working out, do you know what I mean? Something like that, you know what I mean? The problem. And you, like, put in the head, the casting director's head, the problem, and you'll be able to solve that problem, you know what I mean? And then you're always going to be top of mind when they come across a situation like that. Do you know what I mean? So what is... And then what you've got to think is, um, if you do discover your niche, which took me a long time, and do your research on, like... Because everyone takes the headshots, and the headshots are just, like, same headshots, what everyone says, everyone sees, you know what I mean? Do your research on your casting type, your niche... And just like, have a look at famous celebrities, their headshots, what are in your niche, what are exactly the same as you, the, you know, the Cockney um, computer guy or something, type in chat GPT, do you know any other actors, what are computer, computer, Cockney guys, you know what I mean? And it'll come up with you. Have a look at the headshots, and then just try and like, see what they like, see what you've got to do your headshots like, you know what I mean? And then, like, think of for sure your own material. I know, might not, might not look like a lot of DIY and stuff, but um, for sure your own material, think suitable roles for your niche. Not necessarily acting out exactly your niche, but a role what maybe could... Um, suit your niche or maybe you could bring to character in your niche, you know what I mean? And that'll put you at the top of mind of the casting directors. And it's not just about your niche though, because like everyone is going to think, oh, he's just that guy, you know, it's all right saying I'm the best bodybuilder in the world, which is not true. You've got to think about what sets you apart from other people. Do you know what I mean? Like, what, what is the difference between your, you being the Cockney 
computer guy and someone else being the the computer guy. What's the difference? What's so? What makes you different to the other guy? You know I mean, it, it's not kind of just say, oh, I'm better than him. I'm better than me. That's what it's. It's like everyone's gonna say they're good. Do you know what I mean? So like, you got to think, like, I don't know. Um, you can make someone look like. Um, I love wearing sunglasses or something. Just something. It's an example. You know what I mean? And that is the way you can turn your CV from the problem. The problem solve what isn't even there. Like for example, I love gangster music, Guy Ritchie movies. And if there were, for example, I always wanted to represent London in the social network Guy Ritchie film, for example. And you're the first person what's going to pop into the red. You get me? Uh, and that is just the way of, if you get your headshots right, you show you like, it's, it's like a ripple effect. It's just going to, Take off, man, and it's going to be absolutely amazing.